Welcome to this video on installing Lightroom presets. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install both types of Lightroom presets, that's XMP, the newer version, and LR template, the older version. And I'm also going to show you how to install these presets to Lightroom Classic CC, which we're looking at here, and Lightroom CC, which is the newer version, as well as its mobile counterpart, Lightroom Mobile. Before we get started, I will say that Lightroom has a habit of constantly changing these small and seemingly minor details such as how to install Lightroom presets. It seems like every time there's an update, the location and the mode, mode that you have to use to install these Lightroom preset changes. So if that's the case and you're looking at this in a month or two's time and you find that the Lightroom preset installation method is not working anymore, just leave a comment below and I'll make sure that I update this video. It's a little bit tiresome, but it's actually a little bit better than it used to be. So they've slightly improved the process here. So Lightroom presets come in two different files. We have LR templates, and this is the older version of the Lightroom preset. And we also have XMP. Now this is the newer version of the Lightroom preset. They've updated it in the past couple of years and LR template will work on all versions of Lightroom. That's why we provide you with LR templates. And the XMP will only work on the latest versions of Lightroom CC and Lightroom Classic CC. So we're gonna show you how to install both versions of these presets in this video. To get started, open up Lightroom Classic, and this is just the Lightroom Classic method here, and go to Preferences. Down here we have two options, Show Lightroom Develop Presets and Show All Other Lightroom Presets. I'm going to open up both of these folders. We have them here side by side. Right now you can see that the develop presets folder right here and the settings here are both empty. And I'll also provide the paths to these folders in the section below. But you see they're both pretty much empty. We have a user presets and we have an index file here as well. So the way I'm going to import LR template files which is the version that we like to provide you with, is to open up the folder that they come in. And for this version of the video, I'm gonna be importing my entire Lightroom preset collection. I'm gonna select all of them, copy, and then open up the develop presets panel and hit paste. And now what I've done is I've copied all of those presets over to the Lightroom storage section for my presets. For them to appear inside Lightroom, I then have to quit Lightroom and open it back up again. So let's do that. Let's open it back up. And just see, we don't have the presets here just yet, but in a moment it's going to process all of those presets that I just imported and convert them from LR template over to XMP files. Just one moment and it's gonna come up with a progress bar. And what it's doing is it's copying it over to this other location, this other folder inside Lightroom. So it's taking them over from Adobe Lightroom to the Camera Raw settings over here. So that means that these presets will also work with Adobe Camera Raw, which is great. Once that's done, we'll now see that all of these presets are here inside Lightroom as XMP files, and you can browse through them. So you can start with a black and white one, for example. We can go to Muted Highlights. I can add a green filter. Then I can go down, add some lens correction, clarity to high, and I can make my adjustments in just a few seconds, and then we have a final photograph that I'll be happy to share. So that's installing the LR template files inside Adobe Lightroom. Let's do this again now, only we, this time we're going to install the XMP files. So if you have XMP files, this is the method that you want to take. So to do this, I'm going to quit Lightroom. And here I am in the XMP folder over here. I'm just gonna delete everything out of that. And I'm gonna to go to my develop presets folder over here and delete everything out of that too. Let's open Lightroom back up and we'll see that those presets have disappeared. See no more presets at the side here. 
So let's quit out of that. And this is the XMP folder. Let's skip this. And now this time, instead of opening up the LRT, LR template folder, I'm going to open up my XMP folder. So these are all of my presets as XMP files. Select all of those and I copy those. And I put them into the camera raw settings folder here. And once again, the, the locations of these folders will be down in the description section below. And as I open Adobe Lightroom CC, classic CC again, you'll see that they're all here. So that's just something that you need to be very wary of when you import these presets into Lightroom. XMP and LR template files go in different locations. And if you import LR template files, they will be converted to XMP. So just one more time quickly, I'll show you that to install LR template files, you hit on show all other Lightroom presets. And to install the uh, XMP files, we go here to show Lightroom develop presets. Cool, so now that that's done, I'm gonna show you the process of installing these Lightroom presets onto Lightroom CC and Lightroom Mobile. It's a very simple process and it won't take long. So let's quit out of this. And now I'm gonna go and open Adobe Lightroom. And I'll open up the sidebar here for the presets. So I'm in the, the develop section up here and I went to presets. And what I'm gonna do is I'm going to import presets. And I found this desktop folder. So if I go to desktop, Lightroom presets, LR template, I can select all of those and hit import. And it will start to progress and import all of those. And once it's done, you can see on the sidebar, all of my presets have been imported. It's the same process for XMP files as it is LR template files. And if you give your phone time to sync, eventually it will update your phone with the same presets so you can use these presets on Lightroom Mobile as well. So there we have it. That's importing your Lightroom presets to different versions of Lightroom and using different files and on different desktops and mobiles. That's how we import Lightroom presets. That is about as comprehensive of a video as you'll find on the topic. And as I mentioned, I'll leave the path to these folders below in the description. Thanks for watching.